Today we're gonna help PZ9, Melvin, the newest Spy Ninja member, jog back his memory, and we're gonna play the Spy Ninja Trivia Challenge! Yeah. I love trivia, especially about myself. <laughs> PZ9, you were one of the worst starts to our year. I had this awesome safe house I gave Chad and V, and then you and all these other hackers took it over, and now that safe house is gone forever. Yeah, that was really messed up, PZ9, how you did that. That was so messed up. Hey, like, that was crazy. You were part of it, too. You were still PZ4. Ooh, I don't know what to say. Yes, we were part of this mission. We were with a bunch of PZ members. It was insane. And the three of you guys were able to fight us off. Yeah, I put on some armor and I said, follow me, because I'm a hero. After you guys left the safe house, some PZ members were able to get inside, and that's where I discovered my intrigue with the bow staff. Yeah, because I had all my ninja gadgets there. Now they're gone for good. <laughs> Let's watch this footage right here. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Oh. This will be the last time you ever betray us, PZ1. Uh oh, oh, what's, yeah! what's up? What's up? Pause. That hacker looks familiar. Oh yeah, I wonder who that is. All right, Melvin, what happens next? A, you threw Daniel off the bridge. B, Daniel throws you off the bridge. Or three, Daniel hurt his leg. My leg? Yeah, that seems hey. to be his weakest body part. <laughs> if Daniel or the hacker fell off that bridge, well, I don't think they'd be here today. Let's see what happens. Play the clip. Oh! <laughs> 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 Awesome line too. He peaked at the beginning of the year. <laughs> hey, That's great. he's a nice spy ninja. He even asked if you were okay. We're all nice. He was all right. And my back is fully healed now. Thanks for asking. Oh, good. So after that, and all the hackers took over Daniel's safe house, we had nowhere to live except for in V's Tesla. And then someone stole the Tesla. Remember that, guys? Yeah. It's the saddest day. Then we got a very mysterious call to inform us that the Tesla had been changed to this hit play. <laughs> Okay, the question is, who is the one who turned V's Tesla into that amazing DeLorean? Was it A, Regina, B, the Project Zorgo leader, C, Dax, or four, Joseph Banks? Oh, wait, so does everybody already know the answer to these? Oh, I know oh, the I answer. I know what it is. Oh, I think I know. If they stole your Tesla, then it's gotta be someone who's capable of evil, which could have been Regina or B. B. Project Zergo leader. He's Let's great. Throw the clip. Wait, what did you just say? He's not great. He would be fantastic at changing Teslas into DeLoreans. Play the clip. Whoa. Oh, what the Banks? Heck? Joseph? Hey, you, Banks. Whoa. Joseph Banks. Whoa. That guy? That bumbling old man? He's great. Yeah, he has this weird obsession with squishies. Well, V, there's a new Tesla coming out that appears to be hacker-proof. Oh yeah, that Cybertruck. Because that thing has stainless steel all over it. Yeah. yeah. It's gonna be perfect. It looks like a DeLorean. And to know that all of this just happened in January. January was jam-packed. What about February, though? I remember in February, I started documenting for Project Zorgo. That's right, you were the official Zorgo vlogger on their channel. I really hated it. It sucked and it was boring and annoying and not fun. And you just like kept complaining like, well, why am I the vlogger? I'm better at fighting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look where I am now. Like, you know, I was so cringy back then. Back then. Back then. <laughs> what? Besides vlogging for Project Zorgo and seeing you guys on your missions, I also got to see Regina, PZ4 huh? at the time. Huh? What? That was around the time that she started talking with Daniel. Huh? This was the time when I was thinking about leaving Project Zorgo and I kept leaving you, my most trusted colleague, some notes around the abandoned town and I wanted your help. And you helped me. You even act really sketchy in front of Chad and V. They thought you were being weird. They didn't know if they could trust you. Yeah, so we had to follow Daniel all around through this abandoned town. V and I were following Daniel. Turns out Daniel was following PZ or Regina. Hello. All the while, PZ9 was following Regina. It was like a vlog within a vlog within a vlog. But what were we all up to? 
So, what were you guys doing at the abandoned town? A, looking for a school bus. B, trying to hunt down PZ2. Three, going to the abandoned town to look at the cute bunnies and take cute Instagram pictures. Or four, track down the 78X Zero. I know, I know, yeah, 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 yeah. But does anybody else know? Yeah, I remember I was sleeping in one of the buses. You guys read my Apple Watch messages. Yeah, and you were like, Bunnies. He was falling in love with the bunnies. Yeah. I really want to say bunnies, but it's got to be more important than all those other things you mentioned. 78X? PZ9, you are correct! Yeah. Do you guys know what else happened in February? Someone in this room captured me. That person brought me to the headquarters. I got close to the Project Zarko leader, and there was a huge battle royale. Oh, Who was that person? I don't know. Daniel, was that you again? It was some little girl by the name of Regina. Regina! Wow, you guys have a complicated history. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I remember that, Regina. After you captured V, we got into this crazy battle right now. There was all this fighting going on. Mm -hmm. And then during the fighting, the Project Zorgo leader was talking and talking about how he wants to take over YouTube and he doesn't want children watching YouTube and he doesn't want them leaving comments and all this stuff. Project Zorgo is advancing then. They're getting closer and closer to succeeding. What do you mean? You guys hear about Kappa? You think Project Zorgo is behind that? Where they're not going to allow kids to leave comments on videos anymore? Project Zorgo probably is behind that. They want to take over YouTube and control it for themselves. It does sound pretty much like Project Zorgo. February sounds jam-packed and super fun too, but what about March? Um, oh, no. we don't we're gonna talk, talk about, about March. March. No, no. Mm, next. On oh. April. That's when I had a change of heart. I wanted to leave Project Zorgo. I was running and then I came across curse spirit tunnels, if you will. But then Project Zorro found me, of course. You also went in there to rescue her, but not for the right reason. You remember that? Yeah, it's starting to sound familiar. Project Zorgo gave a $10,000 reward for returning Regina back to home base. Yeah. You and I were having a battle royale outside the tunnels, and all of a sudden you're like, I'm gonna go in the spirit tunnels because there's $10,000 reward for Regina. And you just ran in there and then oh, you got lost. PZ9, how long were you trapped in the tunnels for? Was it A, one week? B, five days. C, 11 and a half days. Or four, over a month. Hmm. Do you remember PZ9? Not really. Seems like you guys have a better understanding of what happened. Five days? Because you can't last that long without food and water. Oh. Wrong. What? No, PZ9, you were in there for like over a month. I feel like you were in there for like three months. I guess I have a lot of videos to catch up on. Daniel and I went in there to rescue you. We fed you some water. It's a shame my memory is so crap because I'm sure I have to appreciate you guys for some of these stories. <laughs> yeah. oh, man, we saved your life and you don't even remember. So many times. You know what happened next in the spirit tunnels? You went crazy. Uh, Chad. Something happened the next time we saw you. What happened? Was it A, you had... <laughs> you had dropped your banana all over the floor. B, you had broken your mask in half. C, you had defeated and beat up a ton of Project Circle members. Or D, B and C. The two for one answer. D, you got it. Yep, we're showing some video footage right here. Yeah! You were well crazy, man. Wow. Nuts. And my ninja outfit makes its appearance. Yeah, your iconic look. So Project Zorgo was after Regina. We were after Regina, but in the end, who actually got Regina? Everyone wants me. Oh. What can I say? Was it A, Dan, uh, the spy ninjas? What? Um, <laughs> B, Project Zorgo got her. C, PZ9, or four, police. Oh, God. Oh. 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 Really? I think I know who was after Regina. I mean, we were all after Regina. And I think Project Zorgo definitely wanted Regina as a friend again because you just can't betray Project Zorgo like that. B, Project Zorgo. No. Nope. Oh, I suck at this game. Good thing there's uh, nothing at stake here. Yeah, it was actually the police. I remember that. V, you remember that? Oh, yeah. I was in the jail with Regina. And V got arrested, too. And that was in May. We had to stay in that disgusting cell with a really gross toilet, you guys. We had to come to the rescue and break you out by passing the key up the sewer pipe with our bare hands. Oh, stop. Just, okay, they're clean now. Oh, stop. 
Oh, it's been months. I gotta, <laughs> I gotta itch my nose. And anyways, it was Daniel that put his hand up there. You would. Remember, my hand didn't right. fit. I can't believe you hey. guys escaped oh. a prison oh, like that. that. And you got out. Didn't we get out through that secret trap door? A prison escape? Heck yeah. I went on a bunch of missions all with them, even though I was still masked. And I really felt like I wanted to be a spy ninja. So that eventually led to my unmasking. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. It's a very dangerous task, getting unmasked. Dan, you had a safe one, though. Yeah, I just was a little blurry. No, yeah, you yeah, he never even had a mask on. We did it the tech way. We just blurred it. Yeah, yeah, very like, fitting. You got a digital mask. Yeah. You know, we weren't as picky back then about who joined the Spy Ninjas. <laughs> <laughs> Chad! And then with Regina, you know, she went through this whole challenge, and then at the very end, we unwrapped her like a mummy. Very similar to your unmasking, PZ9. You also got ba- Why is it that everybody gets bandaged up? I mean, we did engage in one of the most epic Battle Royales of the year. I kicked you right off that gazebo. You went flying, boom. And I said, gazebo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I had to bandage up my entire face to hide my injuries. Your face looks fine now. It feels very fast. Thanks a lot. <laughs> are, are you hiding all your injuries underneath that big beard? <laughs> yeah, you, you wanna. Whoa. <laughs> my chin's actually this long. <clears throat> All right. June was a very crazy month because Project Zorgo made a signal booster which they hooked up to this device that allowed them to hack things from really far distances, including other YouTubers, and they could hack into their YouTube channels. We caught wind that they were trying to hack one of our YouTube friends. Does anybody remember? Was it A, Ryan Higa, because he lives in Las Vegas as well? Was it B, Mr. Beast? C, Steven Sharer, or four, Faze <laughs> Rug. Hey, bless you. <laughs> this <laughs> one's easy. I think Mr. Beast already works with Project Zorgo. So they what? Need... How do you think that? Well, how does he have all this money to do all of his crazy challenges? But Mr. Beast is doing good things, like planting trees and stuff. Because you mentioned a single booster works off of proximity, which is the distance in relation to another item. It's gotta be Ryan Higa, because he lives here in Las Vegas as well. Do we concur, Spy Ninjas? Hmm. I wish I knew what concur meant. Yeah, Not divide and conquer. It means agree. If you concur, you agree. Sometimes I concur, sometimes I don't. This time I do not concur. The answer was C, Steven Scherer. Check yes. out the clip. And then after all that stuff that happened with Steven Scherer, PC9 just comes back into our lives out of nowhere. I guess I made my a grand reappearance. <laughs> there must have been a reason though. Yeah, because then in July, you were part of Project Zorgo to help them do this VidCon thing where they took that signal booster and they were gonna hack all the YouTubers. There's thousands of YouTubers at VidCon. You weren't trying to help them. You were trying to betray them and hack them all for yourself. Oh, go me. <laughs> I'm guessing it didn't work. You don't remember? No, it didn't work because the spy ninjas saved the day. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, uh. yeah. Tell me more about my achievements. Actually, I really like this part of the VidCon mission. Okay. Remember me and you, Chad? We had to share an outfit. It was super comfortable and really <laughs> made sense. We did trick a couple hackers. They thought we were kind of weird, but uh, it worked, you know? I think yeah. we probably could have just done it one at a time, but... You gotta make a good video. <laughs> <laughs> so this was around the time where your guys' best friend, Justin, started appearing. And everybody started thinking, PZ9 and Justin, we're the same person. Yeah, and I was kind of convinced. You know, I saw the beard. There's a lot of similarities. The dark hair. The, the bow staff. staff. Thankfully, we were able to clear the air yesterday with that uh, Skype call with him. Yeah, but it still kind of seemed like you guys were a little too similar. You know, like your brothers or something. I know you're not. Now in August, who led PZ9 to our safe house? Do you remember that? Was it A, V, Quaint? <gasps> or B, Daniel? <gasps> or C? Chad. Me. <laughs> or four. Regina. Or five. Daxton, aka Dax. Talk about multiple choices. <laughs> I think that's an obvious one. I'm just gonna pick the dumbest out of all of them. Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's Dax, of course. Do you still want him in your band, Daniel? I don't know. Yeah, he's good. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a funny joke, right? <laughs> yeah, no. Oh. What Whoa. was that? Nice. I don't know that one. And you B. never will. I mean well, you're right, Bayez9. <laughs> Are you from Liverpool? <laughs> Bayez9. What's happening here? He's laughing. <laughs> What I'm trying to say is, you're right, PZ9. It was Dax. That 
imbecile. <laughs> he is just a spy ninja in training. That's all there is to it. But he led PZ9, you, to the safe house. You don't even remember that because you've had your memory erased, so. Do watching these clips help recharge your memory a little bit? Yeah, it's very nice. And remember, PZ9, that you kept trying to slip us these little secrets about Be Quaint? Yeah, you came into the Spy Ninjas trying to ruin me and my life and my undercover identity. For the past three months, I was undercover as a PZ member. Seeing you betray us like that and us kicking you out. But it turns out you didn't betray us at all. You were helping us secretly I get it behind now. the scenes. I was undercover to get the safe. You had to be a high-ranking PZ member. Yeah. And once I got that safe, whatever's inside it would destroy PZ forever. In September, we had our first ever Spy Ninja tryout yes. to replace V Quaint. Hey, we thought you were leaving us, so we needed a new Spy Ninja member. In September was around the time Project Zorgo started using that B-235 a lot. We still don't know who our true family members are. Yeah. Your parents are probably out there looking for you. If my parents are watching, this is what I look like. Now, they'll, now that you have your mask off, maybe your parents can find you. Maybe you didn't even have a beard last time your parents saw you. I bet your mom would love if you shaved that beard. Well, maybe it's all right then if they don't recognize me. What? <laughs> and then at the end of October, after all that B235 nonsense, Project Zorgo is throwing a Halloween party. We were trying to find Regina. Yeah, because I just figured out that Daniel was the one who erased my memory. I think I was like mind controlled or something. Yeah, he, he got his memory erased too, Regina. You feel bad for him. And then in November, we had Thanksgiving. We started becoming friends with PZ9. Yes. We even formed a band. Yes, we did. It was awesome. It was so good. I loved you so much, man. Oh, yeah, and I had to start sharing a room with you, and I really got to know your snoring habits. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then December happened. Then we learned that, oh, maybe we should have listened to V, who said we should be careful with PC9. Yeah. Because he betrayed us. Sorry we doubted you, V. Yeah. I don't know when we guys learned to trust me all the time. I trust you. I just don't believe you all the time. <laughs> Wait, that's not, what, that's not what I mean. Okay, so maybe December wasn't my best month out of all these months, but I made a huge decision, and that was to forever abandon Project Zorgo and um, to pick up my new crowd. And you made the right choice. Now you're hanging with the good crowd. Yeah! Hey. yeah. It's pretty sweet. That's a lot of stuff that happened in just one year. And that's probably not even the tip of the iceberg, isn't oh it? Oh my gosh, there was so much more that happened. And we hit 10 million subscribers just recently. So that's a big thing that happened this year. This has been a really great year, even though there was lots of crazy things that happened with Project Zorgo and bad things. But it's been a really good year. And we really want to thank all of you Spy Ninjas who have been with us all year long. I see all your comments, even one saying, I've known the Spy Ninjas since even before 2019. So thank you for being with us all year. 2020 is gonna be amazing because we're gonna defeat Project Zorgo, our New Year's resolution. Yes, and I aim to help with all that. Yeah. yeah. And if you wanna be part of the action, helping the Spy Ninjas defeat Project Zorgo, make sure to subscribe to Chad, to me, to Daniel, to Regina, and Melvin. <laughs> and to watch all of our videos from the year 2019, click right up here somewhere. You'll be watching for like 80 hours. Have fun. But you're in Christmas break, so you have plenty of time. Plenty of time. The last kick bump of 2019. Kick, kick, kick bump! bump!